hello guys this is Kaur here today I am implementing transport list security in WCF there is a two three steps first one we have to remember always first of all I have to configure IS IS configuration of IS IS first of all I am opening IS run as administrator Then I am clicking on server certificates and removing the certificates. Now I am adding the self certificate like demo on YouTube. Demo that is my SSL certificate name. I have created this and I click on and uh, I am getting the thumb print from here I'm copying this and uh, I copy that and paste it on a text file I will select all the text and replace space with replace all Means we have to remove the space from all the things now I have to create the WCF service that will be used for SSL certificate WCF service uh, layer SSL site is all service name I'm creating this and I created this and now I'm opening from tools to create GUID and getting the registry format from here I copied that also and paste here now I'm again going to IS here I use here that is that and uh, I added the hair bindings I have removed this and uh, add again like HTTPS and selecting or SSL certificate demo on YouTube and with port number 443 and registering this now I have to add register this SSL with port number from the Visual Studio command prompt like we have to go to I am going to 10 Visual Studio tools and uh, run as administrator up now show SSL card that is showing that in my system I have registered SSL certificates here now I have to delete the previously defined SSL certificate on my laptop uh, that I am using the port number I am using the port number uh, that is registering my SSL certificate with this port number I have to HTTP at SSL side IPPO RT 
that is 0 0.0.0.0 0 0.0 0.0 0 0.0 0 0.0 sort hash is equal to now I'm copying the hash code that we have paste here earlier copy here and paste here now uh, remove question mark from here and go in and now we have to mention here f i e that is we have paste here earlier and we copied it now I am pressing enter that all SSL that we get successfully added now where I am going again in IIS that is over I have to uh, I have to mention I will have uh, not, uh, authentication methods first of all I have enable the anonymous authentication method and basic authentication method the rest will be disabled like uh, Uh, here I'm mentioning and now I mentioned here uh, now I'm going to WCF I am modifying WCF according to my requirement um, PRP or it's working I modified WCF now I'm modifying it WCF interface that is our function we will use to add client test of to the chat services now I am doing now we have um, I will use the binding WSSTTP configuration no this is my binding configuration and this is my behavior configuration I'm using here and I have to do this also no check if it's working or not yeah if it's working then you can test now working I'm using this now. I'm creating a website. Now I'm 
adding here or service reference don't forget to do here as uh, this is our certificate that we are registered to IIS that is and all issued by that is my PC name that is unknown PC and to valid from this to this and the using this and I have to mention I have to give my authentication here that is my system name in username I have to system name password that is my system password is PRM I have done and you done with my service I added the service here I am adding the default platform page here now I am adding the button here single button here where on the click I will use you know, the service here yeah, service the French one dot service client as service go to new then our service is now our method is get data and Return type is string like from here, like all that is, and we mention here it's working. Now, I uh, we are now we are testing here that our SSL certificate of working on transport layer secure is working or not. If we are not providing here our username password access and it's is it is it it will not work if our certificate SL certificate is working like first of all I have to I have to stop my evolution service and then run again when I click on this button it's return the yep it's working but it's not work here because I am not providing here username and password now I have to provide dot client credentials dot username dot username that is my system name UN or UN and SI dot client credential dot email dot password that I am that I gave on the on the on the time of reference when I am taking the reference of the service now this will work fine because I am providing I provided here the authentication username password here and now I am testing yeah it's working it's give the totally respond response here I used and WCF like WS HTTP binding with SSL certificate transport layer security that is my online demo on transport layer security if you are if you all having any problem with it to talk technologies you can mail me on borrow bansa 74 at the gmail.com thank you thank you guys thanks a lot